Alexis. I'm from Highland Moss and I have also Mara with me today. He's sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to show you how to set up Moss Pro on uh, different kinds of Moss there. A lot of people are asking me, oh, can I use uh, your Moss Pro on, for portals or string of hearts? And the answer is yes, you can use this with any plant, which is climbing. So for example, here I have a mini Moss Pro with Pink Princess. I have also some um, variegated string of hearts on the uh, heart shape moss pole which is also super cute it's not in stock yet but will be again uh, another example i have super cute um photos now and i think it will look amazing on the pink moss pole but this i will show you in different video uh, today i'm going to use this monster minima and i'm going to use this cute pink most pole. This is the mini size. Uh, the smallest one which you can get from our shop at the moment is 60 centimeters. But if you need something tiny, just let us know. We can make 30, 40, 50 centimeters if you need it. So the steps are super easy to follow. Uh, it's exactly the same like with other plants. You have to find a spot where you would like to uh, put your moss pole. So a little bit far away from the roots, but also close enough to the plant. So we, you will be able to support it. So how I'm going to do this, I'm going to put finger inside and make small hole just to make sure that it won't damage the plant. And if you if you won't be able to find a nice spot, if you put more spot and you will feel like, oh, maybe it's too far away or too close, you can just make another hole. Uh, so this is more spot. And I'm trying to put this here. Pull just a little bit, but also be careful don't damage anything so my idea for the plant today like you see there's like there's two parts of the plant so I would like to take this one and put around the moss pole so when it will grow it will go nice away around and this one will be just nice hanging part climbing and hanging and I think it will look very it will look very nice um, Okay, so if, I, if you're happy with the position of the moss pole, push more, you can secure it by pushing the soil around. Okay. And you could leave like that, or you can make it even cuter. And I have some more pink moss here, and I'm going to put on the top of the soil. And it also not only looks very nice, but helps to keep nice level of moisture. So when I spray my monstera, I'm spraying moss pole, um, moss on the top of the soil and also the plant and they're growing like crazy, especially now when we have some nice sunny days in Aberdeen. Can you see? It just look very nice. Uh, if you're buying moss pole and you're thinking that this look good, you can always grab a bag of the pink or green moss. We're selling them separately for, for plants, so it's not only that you can use this for propagation, for example, but you can use it for just this one. You actually can put this on the top of the soil for the plant, which doesn't require it. Moss pole, just to make it look cute. Just leave it here. And just spray this a little bit. Okay. okay. Uh, it could be like that, but I don't like the nursery part. I have very nice uh, ceramic pot, and also nice uh, thing to do is put some of the clay pebbles on the bottom, just a little bit. I usually try to fill in like one, maybe one and a half centimeters, even with the water just to the half, so the pot will lie on the pebbles, but it won't touch the water. And it's going here. Okay. So this is the final look. I like it. Let me know what do you think. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye.